a rehabilitation facility in Rapid City, is seeking help from the community in the fight against drug addiction. Brad Walton visited the CARE campus today to find out about the next steps in building a healthier community. Most establishments in downtown Rapid City hope to see familiar faces coming through their doors, but for CARE campus, it's troubling. We have folks who have used it over a thousand nights, so it's, it's taught us a great deal. CARE Campus is a public addiction treatment and rehabilitation facility. Many people have left the campus with newfound sobriety, but this isn't the case for everyone. To see the same people come through our doors in the same condition and worsening condition as they get older and their, their, you know, a lot of their, their health is deteriorating and they're just not making better choices. It's hard to sit in a room full of folks and say, what can we do? The CARE Campus has seen more than 90,000 admissions since their move to Kansas City Street in 2018. Over 80 percent of those who use the facility identify as Native American. Mueller and Tice hope to work with Native American leaders in the Rapid City area to discuss potential solutions. They hope to integrate cultural themes into their treatment regimens to help Native American patients achieve better results. We take care of the most vulnerable in our community 365 days a year. They do amazing work, but they need help. Care Campus is actively recruiting qualified individuals to work as detox technicians and counselors. For those interested in these positions, more details can be found at CODATV.com. Reporting for CODA Territory News, I'm Brad Walton.